It's an elf that lives in the plastic and it keeps it strong. I'm gonna go with the sea creature. I don't know what a polymer is because I'm doing protein. Polymer, give me a hint. That's who poly means many mers. Oh. Mers like in meerkats, so maybe <laughs> lots of little animals. Polymer, so it's like a shape. It's a poly and it has a mar at the end. What? What's a polymer? Do you know you're, you're hold, you guys are both ho holding a lot of polymers right now? The skateboards? I don't know, something to do with the hand, I guess? Palm, polymer? Any something. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what the mer part is. Any ingredients? For the plastic material. I Ooh, it's, a, it's a synthetic plastic, isn't it? Polymers is grip paper your skateboard. It's a group of molecules, actually, if I remember right. Yeah. It's just like a, a group of molecules all put together to make like some kind of material. This checkerboard is like a polymer because a polymer is a chain of long chain of molecules that has a repeating pattern. It helps with recycling. Thermo polymer molecules are generally linear or slightly branched. This means that the molecules can flow under pressure when heated above their melting point. Thermoset polymers undergo a chemical change when they are heated, creating a three dimensional network. After they are heated and formed, these molecules cannot be reheated and reformed. Comparing these types, thermoplastics are much easier to adapt to recycling. Yeah. It's a polymer, because he's got DNA and protein and sugar and stuff. Yum. This wood is a polymer, because it's out of DNA. The plastic in here is a polymer, because it's plastic. <laughs> and it has lots of molecules, and that's what polymers mainly are. This is a polymer, yep, because it's got cellulose and everything. In it. Nice car, Emily. Is it yours? Thank you. Um, these rubbers on the tires are polymers. Yeah. And yeah. the metal is polymer. The leather seats are polymers. This rubber is a polymer! The rubber on your tire is a polymer. Okay. And the metal and the alloy is a polymer. And this little dice thing, which is really cool, is a polymer. <laughs> and these wires and everything. And your helmet is a polymer. Recycling is good for polymers because they are what you recycle. Are polymers, they, but they have different rates of, of recyclability. So these kind of polymers are are very have lots of thermoplastic polymers, which means it can be recycled very easily. And the lower the number is, it goes from one to seven. The easily, the more easily it's recycled. So this is an example of a one. These are twos. These are threes. And then this is a six. So this isn't a very good recycled product. All plastics are polymers, and because this plastic has a low number in its triangle circle thing, it has a better way of, of being recycled, which makes it so it can be made into other stuff easily. This material is PET, but uncoated plastic is PVC. So when PVC and PET mix, then the batch is not good. Yeah, you can't recycle it anymore because PVC plastics are uncoated and you can't recycle them because they won't reform.